Hello, you guys, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. I've got my pre-workout and creatine little mocktail here. And today is an Orange Theory day. So I'm going to go to Orange Theory. My daughter is actually coaching this class. This is why I take specific classes during the week. I take Tuesday and Thursday because she coaches. So she's going to, um, I mean, I'm going to go head over to Orange Theory. We'll see her take her class. After that, I have a tight morning. I want to try to get some steps in on the treadmill when I get home. Then take a quick shower and get ready to go get my tattoo. I have a tattoo appointment today. So that's on the horizon. And then um, as far as the rest of the day, I'm not quite sure. So I guess we'll we'll just have to see. But thanks again for tuning in to another day of Vlogmas. I cannot believe we're on Vlogmas Day 8. But here we are. I'm driving and I'm kind of like trying to plan out the next few hours. I was going to try to come home, do my steps, take a quick shower, try to eat and rush. And then I realized it's just going to be too much rushy, rushy. So I'm going to take a breather and come home, take a shower, eat something. You don't want to be like fasted or hungry when you're getting a tattoo. Um, to eat my oatmeal. And then since I just do, I'm just going to do slow walking, like low intensity while I edit and stuff. I will do that when I get home from the tattoo appointment. So I'll probably be able to get on the treadmill by like two o'clock or so. So that is what I'm going to try to do. But I am going to eat, Mike and I are going to eat some mega fit meal later and there are ones we haven't tried so the steak burrito bowl and the chicken burrito bowl we're going to show you those and um i will have one of the oreo cheesecakes so you guys can see that too so i'm excited to get my tattoo so we shall see how that goes i'm not excited for the pain but when it's pain with a good outcome with a cool outcome it's more tolerable all right, you guys, it's a rainy, cold day in California, but you got to get it in regardless. This is a perfect example to show you that, you know, sometimes my days are not super regimented. I've got to kind of like plug and play and make things work. I have lots to do. I've been up since 4 a.m. I know a lot of you have been requesting for my morning routine, I'd like to show you my morning routine, which I'll, I'll definitely insert, I'll do one video where I insert it, but it won't be a lot because it's more, it's a lot of computer work, but I'll kind of show you exactly what I do when I first get up and, um, but I'm definitely also going to show a night routine as well in Vlogmas. So stay tuned for that. And again, if you guys, if there are other things you guys want, if you notice, I'm really trying to honor requests so far. And so if there's other things that you want to see, by all means, comment now is your chance during vlogmas um yeah so thank you guys so much for tuning in so far and off to orange theory we go Orange Theory was a great workout. I love going there when I just don't want to think, you know? It's always a guaranteed good workout when you don't want to think about what to do. It's just, that's what I use as my cardio. That's probably the only cardio I do. So three classes a week, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday on most weeks. And that is what I would consider my only official cardio. Um, Everything else is maybe a little bit of warm-up cardio at the gym, but not much. And then everything is low intensity, like lists I call low intensity steady state. And that's where like heart rate is going to be somewhere between, you know, 110 to 135 beats per minute. So yeah, that's kind of my regimen. And then I work out three, three to four weightlifting sessions a week. If I do 
two Orange Theory classes, I do four weightlifting sessions. If I do three Orange Theory classes, I do three weightlifting sessions. And then one day a week is a rest day. That's usually Sundays for me. Um, I know it sounds like a lot, but I mean, it really, it really isn't. Like the low intensity workout, I, I stack, I layer with work. So I don't count that time it's because I'm not taking additional time to do that. And then, so my actual exercise is one hour a day, six days a week. So it's either the gym or Orange Theory, but it's an hour. And when it's part of your routine, it just kind of is like autopilot. Like there's never a time I don't go unless like I am super sick. And that's the only time that I might skip a workout. All right, you guys, I am dressed for my appointment. I've got my like comfy Anina Bean sweatsuit on, some New Balance sneakers. I wore a tank top because I wanted just him to have full access to my arm, but I brought a sweatshirt that I can throw on after. It's a little matching set. Um, right now, I'm gonna make myself some oatmeal, nothing nothing too exciting or anything that you haven't seen so I'm excited though it's almost time I'm sure you guys are sick of seeing me make oatmeal by now but I am a creature of habit and it's so filling it's just very satisfying meal so I like to have it By the way, these are the muffins. They kept really well. Super delicious. There is only seven left. So five of them went yesterday. And we have no protein powder for my oatmeal. That sucks. This is why I love one of Nutrition's samples. They come in handy, so we're gonna do salted caramel in here. Yay. So 16 grams. All right, you guys, let's look at my tracker. If I don't plan out my day in its entirety ahead of time, then I'll at least start to plug things in after I eat one or two things so that, you know, I don't get caught off guard. Um, so this morning I had my protein bar early, early this morning, and then I just had my oatmeal. So that's plugged in right here. And those are the only things I ate. So I decided, okay, let me plot out the rest of my day. Um, after my appointment, I figure I'll come home and have my little yogurt with raspberries and chia and some nut butter. I'm not going to have granola. I took the granola out because I wanted to kind of play with the rest of the day. So then I'm going to have my Mega Fit Chicken Burrito Bowl, which I will show you guys when I have it. And then I'm also going to do a serving of sweet potato tortilla chips. And then as my bedtime snack, I'm going to have the Mega Fit Cookies and Cream Cheesecakes. I wanted to show you guys all of those things that I kind of promised you on the last Vlogmas. And so this is my day kind of all planned out. So the rest of the day, I kind of just treat as a checklist and I just eat it whenever. And I am my goal is to hit 120 grams of protein or more and to stay within 1,550 calories. So there you go. That is a good day in my book. Also with the app, um, what I do for the Mega Fit meals to get the macros in, especially if it's a meal that I'm gonna order frequently, I'll add it as a custom food so that it's just in there. So the MF cookies and cream cheesecake, 
the Mega Fit Chicken Burrito Bowl. It's all just saved into the app. So you can't... Um, What's your artist's name? David. No, not David. Mike Suarez. I'm going to tag him. I'm going to put his Instagram up on here. He does excellent portraits. Look at this. You're nice. It's got the film on it, and he still needs to touch it up in a couple of weeks. But look at the eyes. Like, that is the part that I really wanted... Hold on. To capture her eyes. And it, he really did a good job. The nose, the lips, just everything. Wow. It looks so good. You should go show the picture over there. No, but th this one is better, more clear. Damn. It's pretty big. <laughs> it is a pretty big piece. I may as well just sleeve up the rest of the bottom half of this arm. Yeah, might as well. Because look. It just has a gap. Yeah, you're gonna have to now. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. I love it though. So I just got home from my appointment, obviously, and Mike's got his little lunch right here too. It was three and a half hours, you guys, but I braved it like a champ. Um, so I'm having my little yogurt right now, and then I have quite a bit more work to do today because yesterday, the internet and our 5G. So we couldn't get on any apps at all, even on our phones, plus the internet were out all day long. But this is why it's good that I get up at four o'clock in the morning and do the bulk of my work because I had gotten up at four, done a bunch of work, then by the time we got home from the gym, the internet was out. So we were dead in the water. And then the Starbucks around my house were packed with people. Because obviously, we weren't the only ones out. They're doing some sort of road work near our street, and they must have messed something up. Your meal looks very good, babe. Look at that. Look at that. Potatoes, eggs, burger. Yep. Delicious. But he's going to, dinner is the mega fit meal, so mm -hmm. we'll show you guys that later. All right, you guys, Mega Fit Meals Chicken Burrito Bowl is what I'm having. And when I have time, I prefer to heat them up like on the stove top or the air fryer. So I'm going to put this on the stove top. I'm gonna add a tablespoon of this taco sauce also. So let me open up my tracker. I have also tracked chips, so we are going to have some chips. All right, there it is. Delicious. Mike is gonna make his steak one, so we'll see what that one is like. This, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10, I'm not even kidding. Okay, there's Mike's steak bowl. And he's also got some chips and salsa. Cracked into his macros. Gotta get your, gotta get the verdict. We gotta get the verdict, huh? You've already had this before. What? I think I've already had this one before. No, I, it wasn't, it's not the same one I got you before, is it? I believe so, Is yeah. it the same one? Oh, shoot, sorry. No, it's good. Why do you have to be oh, sorry? Oh, the chicken one is delicious. You don't have to be sorry, I'm gonna enjoy oh. this. 
Can we give you sorry? I was trying to get different ones. It's all right. Come on. Come on with me. You're not going to be sorry about them. It's going to go. Oh, where did the taco sauce go? I don't know. You just put it away. I had it out here. Oh, yeah, I did. I did put it away. <laughs> I have a problem. I put things away too soon. <laughs> Occupational hazard. I just am always putting things away. Yeah, you got this taco dip. If you guys have not tried this taco dip, it's a staple in our house because it, it's good on like everything. You could even use it as a salad dressing. Oh, it's 28 grams. 30 grams. Oh. It's good. You know what's interesting is, you know, you, you serve yourself chips so often and you measure it out and it's a bowl. It's kind of nice to know that a serving is a bowl, you know? Yeah. It's like, it's yeah. almost like I want to take it with Mexico. me. Remember Mexico? It's almost like I want to take this with me when we go out to a Mexican restaurant. Remember Mexico? Put it in my the, purse. The little bowls? Don't you remember that? Yeah. Cabo, yeah. Little and we bowls. were pissed. Remember we were mad? Okay, you were like, what the fuck is this? Like give me a basket of chips. And they would give us a little basket like this. Like, what the fuck much. is that? <laughs> Bean cheesecake. It is so good. I got them last time. It's got the cheesecake part, and then it does have crust, which to me is a prerequisite for a good cheesecake. So good. We will be enjoying this cheesecake before bed. All right, you guys. Man, what a day. I'm feeling wiped out. I'm not going to lie. This tattoo has got me like a little woozy. You know, it's three and a half hours. It was just like your body starts to just kind of like react. So I feel like I want to go to bed a little early and so that I can get up to have a long day ahead of me tomorrow. And of course, I have another Vlogmas to film. So this is Vlogmas Day 8, over and out. See you on the next one.